What is the Quran? And this guy. Muslims believe that the Quran is the very word of God Almighty. Well, good for them if they choose to do that. I, uh, of course, disagree. A complete record of the exact words revealed by God through the angel Gabriel to the prophet Muhammad. And as I understand it, Mo was not a lettered man. I mean, I, I don't even know if he could sign his name. So, I mean, I mean, I get, but it, it rhymes and you can sing song it in the, in the, and it's probably catchy and it's easy to remember. And I mean, it got written down, but, uh, <laughs> kind of a sloppy delivery system, but I, it worked. I guess anything will work, I guess, if the time is right. The Quran is the principal source of every Muslim's faith and practice. It deals with all subjects that concern us as human beings, including wisdom, doctrine, worship, and law. But its basic theme is the relationship between God and his Creatures. Wow. That's so generous. All that little much. <laughs> uh, whatever. At the same time, the Quran provides guidelines for a just society, proper human conduct, and equitable economic principles. And then we're going to go into uh, Surah 3, verse 3 and 4. He, God, has sent down to you the book, the Quran, with truth, confirming what was revealed before. Same old shit. Repackaged. And he sent down the Torah of Moses and the gospel of Jesus. I suppose. Before this, as a guide to humankind. And he sent down the Criterion, uh, the Quran. And, okay, well, that was informative, I guess. Anyway, that's all for that. And chime in if you have any thoughts. I'm not sure if I have time for another one. This is kind of fun, though. Uh, what's next? Ooh. A long one. I can finish this whole side. All right. Five pillars of Islam it is.